What up, what up, YouTube? Back again with another video. Uh, today's topic, I guess, we can just address how people play Madden and a lot of their frustrations. And one of the reasons why I started making videos was precisely the way people play Madden. In my gameplays, I was venturing out to try to show that you can try to implement regular football tactics into your game and for most online players that I've seen well not gonna say all of them I said most they have a set way they want to play offense and if you don't confine to that way they don't like adjusting it's like this like this double slant stuff you put a defense out there that can stop it it's like they're not gonna adjust it's all routes that cross the field and you just wait for it to beat the zones and you launch it and if you can stop it, then you run into like you run into problems. And this is his what he's basing his offense around is all these crossing routes. But like I said, once you stop it, man, it's over. And then they turn around and get mad and like, oh, Madden sucks. Like, how about you adjust your game plan? <laughs> Just adjust it a little bit. So I'm sure I'll play here on defense. He's gonna come out with me in the you know the meta defense, the man zero zero blitz, man zero blitz. So how do we read this? I'm gonna put my slot receiver on a drag as a bailout, and then if he's not there, then I'm gonna look for the shot on top. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the right guy on the right side of the field on the streak, and just read it that way. And of course, my my tight end is challenging his user that's controlling right now in the middle of the field. So I have no idea. I think he's basing on the out route here on the right side, but you're bumping me, so I'm not gonna do the out route. I'm gonna go streak. Does this make Rod do out route? All right, let's snap the ball and see what happens. You snap the ball, no over the top help. He's watching on the come out, and the top guy's wide open. You know what I mean? It's just regular football stuff. Yeah, he would have jumped the out route if I was doing the out route on the right side. But then again, if you're going to put your guy on the hard flats or quarters on the right side, maybe you should stay on top as a safety. Not freaking dart for the first team to see coming across the middle of the field. You know, it's just... Simple football stuff. You know, it's double crosses. <laughs> I mean, tell me how many times you guys watch me stream and see people run this exact same offense. Where do you think they get it from? Like, where do they get the stuff from? And I had an interesting conversation with somebody online when I told them that Madden is evolving and people need to learn how to adjust or adapt. And they're still playing Madden like the way you play Madden. But look at this on the right side. Bump and run. He, he, he backs off. I hit him with the underneath route. And he misses the tackle. I score another touchdown. Hey, you can only call your offense based on how people play you. And I'm just going to keep giving him the same defense till he beats it. You could block there by the running back. I would have had him in the backfield. And once I see that he does something different on offense, then the more logical thing for me to do is adjust. But if he's going to keep running double slants all game, then I would just keep giving him this till. We find a way to stop him. You know, if more than one person is running this stuff, then you gotta imagine like where you guys learn this stuff from. Like, are you like this is good right here? He's making an adjustment finally. He's gonna see that the slot on the left side is wide open, and he's gonna try to tackle. That's good stuff. Now I gotta adjust. I'm mean, I've seen that, but I gotta react. I see, I react, but I'll you know he gets me. My safety made a good play, but that's good on him. So now I've adjusted my defense based on what he just gave me last time to take that away. I'm not really worried about the drag because I know this guy on the outside is playing the hard flats and is going to come down on it. So he might initially seem open but he's really not open. Because my corners are playing flats for those, like I said, those drags that he keeps sending. The, you know, the double slants. And yeah, we take him again. You got to force him to scramble. You know. Like if he had a, uh, a set way of passing the ball before he snaps the ball, he will run into this problem where he has to scramble to look for a wide open guy. All he's doing is just running streaks and come and and um and comebacks. My mistake here, I send the guy after so I should have stayed with him. Completion. Well, hey man. Sometimes stuff's gonna happen. But you can see the difference between when you play with a sense of what you're doing on the field as opposed to just going out there. Like people tell me on the screen, why do you take so long to snap the ball? I have to just get online swimming and snap it. Like, no, I need to know what the defense is in. Like, he's not checking for my defense. He doesn't know what I'm trying to run. He's not, you know, it's just he has these routes that are going to cross the field, and I have to sit in the pocket and wait for them to cross. 
<laughs> this is a, this is just uh, I would have had a pick right here. Tight end pass to the safety, and I jumped underneath. Ah, so he scores off of that. But you kind of see the concept of that, you know. <clears throat> so I'm gonna put the ball on the ground since so he keeps calling this zero blitz and run the ball a little bit here. You know, the first question you always got to ask yourself is, what are you trying to accomplish? Like, not everybody plays the same way. Everybody in Madden that plays Madden isn't dumb, <laughs> you know? You can't play everybody the same way. Some people do that. They'll take the same game plan into every single game. And then wonder why they have run into problems. Like, d don't play those schemes. Like, play your opponent. What is your opponent doing? What are you trying to accomplish? Like, attack your opponent, not, you know, the scheme comes in, in a play based on what you think your opponent is doing. That's how you implement a scheme. But you don't just come up with a scheme and just say, I'm running this scheme. And what if it doesn't work? What are you going to do? You're just going to keep forcing, jamming, jamming the play and messing up your game? <clears throat> he went into, down in the hole here because he's forcing the scheme down my throat. This is cover three right here. It says window is squeeze, touchdown. And this is the reason why I say I can't play so many games because after a while my brain starts to fry. Because I'm thinking for every single person I'm playing against. I can't play everybody the same way. I come on base defense, see what it is you're trying to accomplish. And then I start taking parts of the field away based on what I think you're trying to do. Like you should think about it like that when you play. Don't just be like, Madden sucks, Madden this. Like there are certain things in Madden that sort of kind of still sort of works. You know, everything doesn't always work 100%, but you can get a good playing game if you just think a little bit. As opposed to just complaining all the time. So that was a, that was a conversation. It's a pretty interesting one. So I got a subscriber off of it, which is good. He's just willing to play. You know what? All right, let me, uh, instead of screaming that Madden sucks, let me try to <laughs> see what you do on here and then, you know, hopefully change the way I play. Like, adjust. <coughs> And you get more enjoyment out the game that way. I think I was listening to Drifter the other day. He was like, you know what? I started having more fun playing Call of Duty when I stopped taking it so serious. <laughs> so hopefully that helps. Alright guys, man. The video's coming to an end here. Just trying to move on down so you already know what's about to happen. Alright, on to the next video. Or maybe the next stream. I'll holla at you dudes. Later. Alright, one.